Hi Pisces, it's Elle here to do your next 72 hour energy reading. Thank you for being here. Thank you for liking, sharing, commenting, and subscribing to the channel. It is much appreciated. All links are below if you need to get in contact with me. Let's go ahead and jump into this Pisces. Thank you Lord God for blessing Pisces. It was a clear, concise message from you. Alright, so Pisces, what we have is the Nine of Swords. The Empress coming up. All right, so we got nine and three coming up. Um, give us another three. Um, gives twelve, which is another three. So someone could have communicated to the other person um, what this Queen of Swords at the bottom of the deck. They could have communicated to the other person that they wanted. Uh, a third energy cut off, cut out. Um, somebody found out about a third energy and they said, you, you know what, if you're giving this person money, if you're taking care of them, if you're putting them up on a pedestal, I want to stop now. This person is not stopping the relationship or the marriage, but they're, they're asking that their person or their partner stop whatever they're, they're doing. And they're watching them closely. Whoever you're dealing with or your partner's dealing with, it's an older woman type energy older energy she could be coming off a little jaded scorned um just very executive like she could be coming off very regal and royal you know she has done a lot of time or put a lot of time into her connection her relationship and she's just not gonna let someone come in and kind of, you know, take it away from her and sweep her partner off his or her feet and take them away. With her asking the, the other person, it could be a male, it could be a female, but with this older woman energy who is the executive, who makes the, the, the decisions, who uh, shuts shit down, um, with her asking this energy to cut something off or to cut out the overspending or the overindulgence or the um the just the uh the overage here it's making some other person crazy um if they were asked to cut out a person it's making them uh they're not sleeping well they're having you know bouts of uh, maybe anxiety attacks They sleep in shifts, okay? Um, definitely insomnia, overthinking. They're resting in a sea of thoughts and, and emotions. It's attacking them to not be able to go to, to be with said individual or do whatever it is they want to do. Something is prohibiting them. It could be the woman. It could be the circumstances. Somebody's replaying what another person said over and over to them. Um, someone is freaking out, panicking in, in terms of, is this really over? Is this person not going to ever take me back because I chose my wife? Or I chose my responsibility over them. Um, <clears throat> seems as if this, it seems as if this energy that is on the outside of the connection, she's comfortable comfortable she's resting in abundance she looks good she's about beauty fashion she's just handling her business she doesn't really care and also she could be showing up as the queen of swords too um she could be knowledgeable about the marriage about the relationship um one that the person is obligated to there is separation here for whatever reason and it looks because someone was one was asked to cut another person off or they're being scrutinized or stopped or um they're just being watched you know, a watchful eye is on them so they can't make any moves and it's driving them nuts it's driving them crazy the third party also could have cut this other energy off and said you know what i just don't want to deal with this type of energy this type of relationship anymore and this could be 
how another person is manifesting. The the person that got left, this is how they're manifesting as the nine of swords, as um, the inability to cope with um, not being with, uh, the inability to cope with not being able to, you fill in the blank. They just can't deal with it. Someone is really understanding that it is over. It looks like for some of you too, this is like another story. Well, not it's almost kind of piggybacks off the other stories, but neither one of these women are giving up. They both could know about each other, and they're just not giving up. They're not leaving. They're not do you know. They're not giving up. They're up for the fight. I guess this guy is really worth it. Could be dealing with a Gemini um, or someone in the mutable family. So Sag, Jim, Virgo. Sag, Jim, Virgo. Yeah. It's another one. I can't think. So this is your reading. I hope that it resonates for you. If it does, go over to, yes, yeah, Sag, Jim, Virgo, Pisces. So you could be dealing with another mutable sign. Or this could be how you're coming up. You're, somebody or something is driving you crazy. That The fact that this, this person has another person is driving you crazy too. These two feminine energies could be driving you crazy. If you're a masculine. If it resonates for you, go over to the website, book your own reading there, take advantage of the text question where you can text a question to the number below. You can also donate to the channel by clicking the buy me a coffee link. Thank you, Pisces. Many blessings to you. Take care.